Hi guys, welcome you again to another news. It has just been reported that political talks have borne down the auto spare part market in Lagos State. Not just that, they've shot several persons. A lot of people were injured. A lot of lives has been gone as a result of this. These people are suspected to be political talks and they've borne down the spare part market in Lagos State. What is your take to this? Of recent, we've been hearing about the resumption of insecurity in Nigeria, whereby we've been hearing about a series of attacks that has been happening in different parts of Nigeria. But if you could recall, most of these states affected are the southeastern states and the northern states. But now Lagos State, a southwestern state, is also being affected now. Probably not insecurity, but political talks burning down or to spear part market in Lagos State. Not just that, they are also shooting and several persons have been affected, some with gunshot wounds, while some were even dead. Well, we would like you to see tight as going to the full details of the news to see what is actually happening. According to the full gist, some suspected political talks have burnt down a spear part market in Apapa Ajigunle area of Lagos State. Sahara reporters gather that the hoodlums stormed the market around 2 a.m. on Wednesday and shot a security guard and two other persons before raising down the market facilities. In a video captured at the scene of the incident, which was obtained by Sahara reporters, a man previewed to the incident said, A security man and two other guys were shot dead and they have gone to bury them immediately. An official of the Red Cross at the scene also confirmed that the market was burned down, but he did not provide further information on who was responsible. Reacting to the incident, an online user identified as Freezy said, Akebi's spare part market, although the papa is not so big because it's in a residential area so you have about two to three Odua people congress that is the opc members guarding the market at night ibus have become a target at this period politicians are really using brainwashed people to foment trouble burning people means of livelihood just because of stupid agenda in you know is the lowest pardon in less than four months the market will stand again the people are so cooperative and financially strong so it's just one security man that secures such a market the evils in lagos need to be more vigilant and security awake the enemies of good governance are not going to take things easy with them this is a fight they must win if they don't successfully dislodge Lagos from the grip of these evil cartels, come next gubernatorial poll, they will all be doomed. Another man, you know, Pyro Cash, added. What is your take to this? What is your own reaction to this pen development? Just like what has been said, do you think the Ebos are the most targeted at this moment? Don't forget that the just concluded general election is actually causing a lot in Nigeria. And this incident could probably be related to the just concluded 2023 general election. As we all know that a lot of Nigerian youth were conversing and supporting Peter Obi, uh, candidate of the Labour Party, who is, you know, uh, from the southeastern part of Nigeria. Peter Obi was, you know, expected to win the election, just like the morale everybody has. But unfortunately for him, he came third, not even second. He came third as the PDP presidential candidate. Atiku Abaka came second while the APC presidential candidate, Bolame Tinobu, you know, was uh, fortunate to become the winner and now the president-elect of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. And now the report just coming in says political you know political talks burned down auto spare parts markets in Lagos State shooting you know several persons several persons have been shot some have died some are injured some have even been buried 
now would you relate these to so, they just concluded general elections if these people are political talks who do you think they belong to which party do you think they are working for they burn down the spare part and according to the report the spare part market is mostly occupied by the southeasterners the ables are most you know in this market so would you say some of the opposition parties are the ones who own these stocks and have deployed them to constitute nuisance in this part of Lagos state where we would like you to see tight as you you know we're going to the food comment to see what people's reactions is on this definitely a lot of people want to react to this brand development because this is actually calling for more attention according to philip matthias he reacted and said if you want to expel ibus from lagos do this organize a referendum on biafra once it's carried you will see a voluntary and happy stampede out of lagos or you build a seaport in southeast and return Nigeria to regional autonomy as a means to Biafra. Do this and thank me later. That is what has been said by Philip Matthias, giving you know a huge advice to Nigerians and even the Federal Republic of Nigeria that if probably you have anything in mind that says expel Ibos from Lagos. There's no need fighting, there's no need killing, there's no need con you know constituting nuisance. What you need to do is this organize a referendum on Biafra. If Biafra can be actualized for them, then there won't be any problem. There won't be any issue. Or better still, build a seaport in Southeast and return Nigeria to regional autonomy as a means to Biafra. You will see that everything will be fine and you will have to thank me later. What is your take to this? David Ijoma Doris also reacted and said, This is sad. I hope proper investigation is carried out before concluding the cause of the fire. The last thing we need now is tension between the Ibus and Jurubas. What is your take to this? We've had another reaction from David Ijoma saying that actually what happened is bad and we weren't expecting something of such in Lagos State. He said, I hope proper investigation is carried out before concluding the cause of the fire. The last thing we need now is tension between the Ibos and Yorubas. What is your own reaction to this brand development? We would like you to share it all with us via the comment section. We would like you to let us know your own take on this that has been said. Don't forget that political talks, according to the news, burn down auto spare parts markets in Lagos State. They've shot several persons. Some of them have even been buried. Some are still injured. What is your take to this? We would like you to let us know your own point of view to this that has been said. Thank you guys for listening. Subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.